Chronicle 17, Broken Bonds. That's what we're about to have. Follow... <laughs> Following reports of the attack upon the Grandal border garrison by the reborn rebel army, the former captain of the anti-rebellion force, John T. Hub, was spotted on the plains of the south. At the same time, the Grandal army was mustered and ready for battle. The emperor had declared John T. Hub an, arm, an enemy. The army now marched to destroy him. Mustered. Pre preparations were completed quickly, and the troops organized immediately. It was almost as if they had been waiting for John T. Hub's revolt. There's a spy in your midst. They said I'm revolting. What? Dude, who do you think the spy is? I, um, think it, I think it's probably Michael. I forget who the spy is. Did it say there was a spy in my midst? No, but it, it's reading like that, you know? Okay. Um. Oh, this one. Oof. Oof. I think I remember the strat. For Can you go start at three and then just charge forward? You only hit the two strongholds and then hit the last one? Yeah, that was that was what I was gonna do by going to two, but three is actually a little bit. I think a little bit closer. I don't know. That's what it looks like. Yeah, like go the downward path or the no, center path. No, straight path. I'm gonna go like down. To, uh, down. Because no. there's only two strongholds. Well, the center one is also only two. No. Yeah. One. No. Nope. Other two. center to your right. Up. One, two, three. No, you're counting wrong in the center. That yes, two, yes, up there. One, One, two, two, three. Okay. <laughs> God damn you. Oh, I didn't move anyone else. Oopsies. Yeah, that needs to happen. I want to go downward. Downward dog, they call that. Dude. Yep. Shout out. Shout out yoga. Shout, <laughs> Shout out, uh, what do they call it, calisthenics? Is that yeah. calisthenics? No. Is no, he... calisthenics is like doing like workouts with just your body. Okay. So like, but is yoga not that? I would say no. I think yoga is more of like a flexibility exercise. With uh, with what equipment? With none, but it's not really like a like a strength building exercise. I think calisthenics is typically strength building. Okay. I mean, maybe yoga is. I'm a fat ass, so what do I know? Mm -hmm. but same, 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 same. Yeah. We should we should push our big fat gamer bellies together. Pro in like a sexual style? No, just, oh, just for regular, fun. Regular, just regular style. Oh, I just decisive battle. I disagree. <laughs> uh, I like the lack of energy you put into that decisive battle as you were trying to come to terms with what the fuck I'm talking about. Yeah, well, you know that's typically how it goes. I was gonna mm -hmm. say, is our new thumbnail debuted by now? Uh, yeah, it's it's on. What the fuck are these coins, man? Dude, Ma you're Mario. You're Mario? Super Mar yeah, you're Super Mario. My life is like a video, video game. game. Trying on. What the fuck are the coins for? Dude, you're just you're, you're just fucking cause. robbing them. Just cause. Um, I was gonna bring up is is our new thumbnail live by now, guys? New thumbnail style. Yeah, definitely by now. Oh, okay. So I was gonna bring up for the new thumbnail style. You uh, you made it an effort to put your head first. I didn't make the thumbnail, so. My, you gotta bring it up with my thumbnail guy. Everyone, hit up my thumbnail guy. Here's his uh, Twitter handle. Is he doing all the thumbnails? Uh, so I'm, I had asked him to make a template basically. And guys, we're talking shop. Guys, shop talk. Shop, shop talk inbound. <laughs> That's the shop talk theme. Gotcha. <laughs> it's, got, it's got a very Seinfeld vibe. Yeah, it does. <laughs> Dude, holy shit, it's Kramer. Hey, what's up, guys? Is that I'm so Kramer. <laughs> Yeah, that's Sophidia. That's Sophidia. Yeah. Holy shit. No, uh Wait, she's level she's level sixty, but now now I'm leveled as hell, so it's almost like I don't even give a shit. Correct. Tatsumaki. Spinning Lotus. Um, no, I wanted to bring it up on the on the recording just to make poke fun. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't actually give a fuck. Um oh, no. In fact I think it flows better, you know. Frankly the uh you know, the funny one should probably be in the back. What? 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 Am Understandable. <laughs> who, who, who's ever think is the funny one and the, and I don't the handsome one? Let's not do that. Would you rather be the funny? <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's. I feel like my my feelings are gonna be hurt one way or another. <laughs> who's the funny one and who's the talented? One? What if it's just like you for both? What? I mean, I'm fucked. Well, well. 
well, if you think like that, then that'll most definitely be the truth. That's true. I don't think like that. I mean, if I you need, let it ass, affect you, then my ass needs to shave. But other than that, I'm looking pretty good. Yeah, yeah. No, I think you're the. I think I think you're the handsome and the likable one. I, f- I don't know. I feel like I feel like if we get comments about this, these motherfuckers are annoying. They mean me. No. <laughs> they mean, no way. They mean me as the loud one. I'm always talking about the edging, so I don't know. Yeah, dude, yeah. you got smacked. No, I think you got a likable vibe about you. I think people people go to you and they trust you. Some people they don't know with me. They're like, oh, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's the opposite. You know? You think so? Yeah, I hear John, and I feel I feel comforted instantly. And I think, um, well, that's very sweet of you to say. But I I think I'm an acquired taste. You know? That's what I think about myself. I well, then I acquired you instantly. Uh huh. Uh huh. Shout out. Mm-hmm. Uh, Shout out me. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to you, yeah. Thanks, man. Uh, oh, Check we got our reviews on johnhub.com. So we recently uh, started a, a uh, content board. We're gonna call it. And um, what do you think we're gonna put on it? I think we're gonna. I, th- I would actually genuinely like to put up our nice co- our nice comments. That would be nice. We should have different sections, though. We should have like uh, yeah. Well, I think we should put a little mini one. little mini calendar situation. You know. Okay. Like a little, just a little mini calendar, and like the co- you could see, you could see the crowd can't see it. I see it. Um, yeah. Uh, put a little mini calendar somewhere, right? That's that's one part of it. That's one component. Okay. Uh, someone's gonna be up to retrieve this to catch yeah, all this traffic worried. over here. So I, yeah, I'm not too worried. We might actually be able to beat the clock if we're if we're if we're swift enough with it. But I might not. You might just send Shark back to be safe. No, no, they're gonna respawn, and then I'll send someone. I'll send. I'll send. Oh, like, gotcha. I'll send John T. Hub back. He's. Yeah, he's a he's a reliable guy. He's a good guy. So okay, so a little calendar to to, to just little, keep track. A little calendar, a little section of like recent comments. I think like literally just comments of interest, not even, not even like just nice comments. Like if someone says some funny shit and it's yeah. like a little mean or a little biting, I'm like, fuck it. That'd yeah, be funny. Let's, let's do it. Yeah, like they put like Addison so handsome, it makes me want to cry. Kinda yeah, funny, yeah, you know, like, yeah, like yeah. that would be so biting and just like mean yeah, yeah. You, please you don't sh- say that, please. please. Addison's so handsome, I'm literally going to edge for six months. <laughs> thinking about him. Yeah, yeah, thinking about him, that is. That's kind of hot. You shouldn't tell me that. Okay. We're, on the, we're on the show. I'm going to get, get a... In the words of Natsu Dragneel from Fairy Tale, I'm fired up now. Okay. You ever watch Fairy Tale? I never watched Fairy Tale, no. Fuck you. Oh, sorry. No, it's a it's it's a it's it's like my guilty pleasure. You know uh-huh. how you were talking about like games that are objectively bad but are on your top ten? Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's fairy tale for me. That's fairy tale. No cap. Yeah, that's an anime, not a game. Yeah, but I you know some concept. What you mean. I'm sorry. I should. You know that that's the thing. Some people are super pedantic. You know, they're like, what? What does like, that mean? Uh, they're super like specific about like. Oh well, you you misspoke a little bit. It's like you know oh, what the fuck shut I'm up. saying. Yeah, yeah. that's kind of what I just did to you right now. And it's okay. I didn't understand the word anyways. I failed the SAT. No, no. Did you you failed the SAT? Nah, I actually got a fourteen ten out of sixteen hundred. But damn, you know, I, that's basically a failure in my book. See, I'm a little bit old. I'm a little bit older than you than you kids. So I, when I took it, it was up to twenty four hundred. Yeah, which is crazy too because it's like only a two year difference. Yeah, like that's. Really interesting. They did. They did a little back and forth too. They always like, do. Yeah, it's just a little back and forth situation. They I always, got a. They sort of molly rock on it, you know. I got a twenty one forty. Nice. Wow, uh, that's pretty good. Twenty four hundred. Yeah. I I was like a little. I t- dude. I took like a prep course or two as well. I, I took a prep course. I, do you think that helped at all for you? I do. I do. Okay. I'm not. I'm not a studier, so I think if I didn't have that, um, I would have definitely been at a disadvantage. Okay. I'm not saying it's required for it's need for anyone, or frankly, you even should, especially at this point in education. Mm-hmm. But um, it's definitely I, I it was it was a helpful aspect for my helpful resource my score. for you. Yeah, I was taking an SAT prep course, and two of my friends that were also in the prep course were like, "Bro, we're gonna ditch and go to uh, go to, go to Target instead." And okay. uh, you know, I wish I did that. You know why? Because I, I have the opposite view. I, I, I kind of feel like uh, my experience with SAT prep courses is like they're, they're kind of kind of useless. A little helpful with just understanding the general um, vibe of the SAT, I guess. Dude, mm-hmm. she doesn't fall off there. Nope. I fell off. In a manner of speaking, that is. Yeah, no. Put that shit down. Yeah, put down the fucking blade of b- hula hoop. Wait, I'm fucking... You're nasty. I'm fucking her up. Yeah, you are. I'm not gonna be rude to her and you know slam my big sword down on her or anything. 
did you just did that? No, no, I mean like to like overkill. Like I didn't overkill oh, her. Ass. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. that's polite. Yeah, I just wanted to be polite to her. Um, because she's because that's Tira, bro. You can't. What What is she? Huh? What were you? What adjective were you gonna say? <clears throat> she's hot. She's she's pretty. She's attractive. She's attractive. We'll call her. She, but yeah. should I, but should I really like just go easy on her because she's attractive? Should I really? Yeah, it's called pretty privilege. <laughs> Are Real, you are you that, a pro, are you a proponent of pretty privilege? I'm not a proponent of it, but it's a thing that I think exists. For uh, sure. Yeah, unfortunately, yes. You know, and like whatever, but like it does suck that that exists. You know, I've never mm -hmm. been never been subject to that in my life, you know. Do you think that there's ugly debuff too? 100%. 100%. I think yeah, I I I think so too. Um yeah, that's really just how it works, you know? I don't think I benefit from or 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 you know, or at a, I'm at a disadvantage for me. I think I'm, I think I'm average looking. I would, I mean, I would say you're pretty, you're good looking. Well, yeah. I would, I mean, but I would agree with you. I don't think. But I like compare, yeah, like compared to like someone who's like, oh, this dude's hot, this dude's handsome. I mean, or whatever, you know, like. Okay. Sure. I mean, can you name like a, a fairly known person? Uh, like a celebrity. Yeah, sure. Who is uh, I don't know, fucking Chris Evans. All right, yeah, he's he's very good looking. Fucking Harry Styles, also conventionally good looking. Fucking uh, Glenn Powell. Glenn pa who? Uh, did you see the trailer for Anyone But You? No. Did you see Top Gun Maverick? Yes. You remember the dick pilot? The pilot that was just a dick to Miles Teller the entire oh, time. Oh yes, yes, yes. Him. Oh yeah, yeah. He's conventionally very attractive. Oh, you know who's my boy? Um, Jensen Ackles. You know Jensen Ackles? Yeah, dude. Jensen Ackles is very attractive. Hottie. He hottie is a hottie. Even. You're going to make me rewatch The Boys Season 3. Yep. Because of Have you seen Supernatural at all? I have not. My So my partner's mother's a really big fan of it, and okay. she's watched the show several times over. Yeah, my, my partner's a large, a huge fan of it too. I think if you're if you're a fan of Supernatural, it's almost like a cult. You're not really like a like a oh yeah, I've watched Supernatural. You know, it was it it's was like all you right. watch all fifteen seasons uh, at least three, three times. times. Yeah. yeah, and and then you're like, I love Supernatural. I acknowledge it's a dog shit show, but I love it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So are you are you a Supernatural fan like that? Uh, I'm on season two, almost done with season two, and uh, the I see the battle. appeal. I, I like it. Yeah, I think I'm not, I'm not head over heels for it, but I, I like it. I think it's something that you had to. Enter into the fandom. I'm not. I don't really interact with fandoms very much. Yeah. Anymore either. Are you, were you ever part of a big fandom? Oh yeah. Okay. I used to. <laughs> this motherfucker's tall. I don't think I've. I mean, I'm not sure if I've told my partner this. I need okay. To, so do you want to? You don't have to disclose it if you don't want to. We could. We could. No, no, it's fine. It's funny. It's not. It's not anything like super personal. I can. Okay. I mean, I'm, I might have told her. I can't remember. Um, in any event, I used to run like an anime Instagram page okay. that had like a thousand followers Ooh. and all I would do is I would take a screen cap of an anime, overlace it like one or two times, like on top of one another. And it typically be like picturesque. I put like a pastel filter on it. Mm -hmm. That shit was eight up. Okay. Yeah. Well, how many did you get? Like, a? did you reach a milestone of followers that you were like, God damn uh, a thousand, a thousand. That's pretty good, man. That's pretty yeah. good. Do you still have the account? I don't. I, I, uh, when did I get rid of it? Don't del you deleted it. 10th grade maybe no yeah. shot ninth ninth or 10th grade i, oh, I forget what no. happened i just i had to get rid of it for some reason <laughs> did you, i didn't did have you just to, think it was a little did. cringe or something and you were like i'm getting rid of this i think i just i you know what i can't wait ninth exactly. or 10th grade you got rid of it i think so that's crap i have a story to tell next next time on game grumps next <laughs> no next time on on a and j a and j yeah <laughs> <laughs> Did you also get rid of a, a fandom page? This well, I'll I'll tell it oh, after well, you read the thingy. Well, oh, okay, bet. 